All right, let's watch Spayer, Spire, uh, PK versus United. PK won this match very convincingly, so let's see what they did. We're really excited to see if United can turn it around on Championship Sunday. Fingers crossed for all the fans that they certainly can. I do not even think they broke through three digits. This, uh, I think they stayed at like 80 uh, points or something. Alright, let's see their initials. Oh, sorry. The drop shot is going to be in on Academy. They're going to be sending three outside, two going through the steps, one going through Sanctuary. I feel like a PK. They're mirroring PK strats. On this map. Let's see. Yeah. Uh, let's see what type major. of utility they throw. I think, if I'm not mistaken, number six prays through a smoke at Raver from either from behind. No, it's it was either. Let's just see where that smoke looked like it came from. Because it looked like it came from inside the right side. Yeah. Yeah, so Praise definitely threw a smoke for Powers there. Powers just throws the smoke and it has uh, Kenny with him. They do this. What? All of this is happening? Number two, uh, summons that has monkey's profile picture is shooting from down low. He's shooting them so so much, which actually downs powers. So Kenny is alone. He doesn't even get their kill because he goes to revive powers. They're no shooting, they're shooting. Up, they they keep reviving each other. Raver gets one. Look at this. Number two summons cuts from up top to help this fight. Assist it, right? Meanwhile, meanwhile, um, in a back a monkeys and Frazier still made it the one before as long as they could. You see the uh, since, since summons since he did leave, Explosive is gonna get a uh, power uh, a drop shot for free, but they have nades. Monkeys has nades. Kenny's gonna get staggered there because he never died from the initial. He was the last kill. They used a nade on Kenny, so they only have one now. Um and so the way PK is setting up is they're securing at least one side or they have visual contact on both sides and see which side they're gonna come from they have number three that's an eyed covering the left side and they have number two summons covering the right side to say where they're gonna go and then number four uh monkeys can see all these guys or will see these guys at one floor or another that where they're gonna go and he calls out where to defend so they don't know powers is there but they do see explosive going to that side they're gonna do so they're got their united is gonna split up they're gonna send two six and seven uh praise and kenny to the right side and presumably uh explosive and powers on the left side Better to have it uh, it seems like right now Powers is engaging on a fight with number three with Desonide. Seems like he's secret him, so he's gonna get the kill on him, right? So he's gonna secret him, get a kill like that. Um, monkeys kill Kenny. How did he kill Kenny? Because it was summons was secret So let's stay on this right side. Number two is someone secret number seven, right? So, does he kill him? No, he's probably calling out monkeys to come back to help him so they can do you want him. So yeah, he called out that he's flanking, so they kill him. 
And then number six is alone now. Praise. Now the hill is about to be done for, so they can just get the rest of these points. Ah, uh, Praise was hurt from. Where did Praise take damage from? I don't understand that. I don't know where they got the damage from. I also don't know what happened with Powers and Explosive over here because they got an initial kill, right? But that's not, so that's happening. Number four. Uh, monkeys. He actually was looking at prey, so he probably was putting in damage on him before he went to help summons. Trust in him. Now right. So then that's when he goes, disengages, kills Kenny. He, he might still be hurt from something. Oh, and then you see someone's pistol him, so he has him very hurt. Uh, prey is at a 42 HP, so he's decently hurt. And then they down him. Now, I want to see the same play, but from the left side, because they do get a kill, right? They kill Dezenide. Then what happens? Raver is secretening. <laughs> Raver is secretening, so he kills one. He kills powers for free. <laughs> he, kill, he kills powers for free. And then also kills explosive. So that's what happened on that side. They got secret man. Right? So they're not going to get any use from that drop shot because explosive is going to die. So they got one drop, but we're not able to use it. Now, look at this. Because, this is important, because the hill has less than half its points. Right? They have, PK has 35 points from that hill. It's about to be, uh, you know, less than 20 points. Desonite is the first one to die, so he is going to be the first one to spawn. And now, because all the commotion and all the gunfights are going on here, where does he spawn? He spawns on next. He spawns top left. So he's going to stay there, and they're going to finish that fight, that team fight, because they won it. And does a nice secure that second hill or next hill because you know dying first. So dying first is not always a bad thing. Because they already have position for the next hill. Now the way they're gonna defend this number four is monkey. He's still draining a little bit of the points. There's only four points left, so he I hope he does doesn't get caught out of position here which I don't think so he has plenty of distance but they have one in the hill one in the middle on this car raver and I'm assuming number two and four uh, summons and monkeys are gonna hold the right side the planetarium or I think it's called different on that side planetarium is across from there so raver is get, gathering all the information he sees them going through the steps and going through uh, sanctuary to you know work that side monkeys is going to use the last night yeah to secure one kill so now they can have a 3v2 possibly if they do decide to take it praise and five powers are not gonna they're just gonna hold on so then now uh that's not gives a call out that he has two in front of us so raver rotates back to him they're gonna smoke him out now look at this coverage Look at this coverage. This coverage from PK was really nice because Raver instantly was with Desonite as soon as he said that he had two, right? And then number four, Monkey also is covering his guy perfectly. I'm assuming he mu he must have done that with the with the mark because he doesn't know that um you know he doesn't know that if he's rotating or not through the wall. So the only explanation is that he probably marked them and saw him running this way and then covered it. But that coverage is essential because everyone has help, right? Well, or or cellmating a one v like monkeys is here, and also uh, summons. So then this coverage is good, right? Ravers can help monkeys. He's gonna be a he's gonna get aggressive on powers because he's not. He's in a unfavorable position powers, so he's gonna. You know, capitalize on that. Uh, now, Desert Knight is gonna down uh, Praise. Why he down him, I don't know. I think Praise was trying to contest points, even though Desert Knight has the 
advantage of position. So that happens. Then Kenny tries to run through on his own, make a play. He's going to fight Raver. He is actually going to kill him. So he kills him. Right? And then after... Well, all that... Well, all that is going on. Monkeys kills his kid. So obviously, number two summons kids is... Summons kid is going to rotate to monkeys. Because... You know? Summons is too far back to really do anything. I think here, someone's could have um, had better better coverage on his guy if he saw monkeys doing that. He should have been like at least made sure that he was a little bit further up. So if he did go to monkeys, he could do something about it. Because I don't think he, no, yeah, someone's is not able. To, you can see him starting to go now, but I mean, by the time he gets there, the this uh, gunfight is gonna be over, and monkeys is gonna win it. So yeah. So that's Close over. Kenny does die. Uh, Kenny, Kenny does kill Raver because Raver was looking for monkeys and Desonite. So he's not very um, attentive of his one guy, which would have been Kenny. But they do make up for it because Monkey goes big and kills Powers and then also kills Explosive and then finishes off Kenny. So monkeys was a going in. Look at the score, guy. Uh, critical now in favor part of and what a maintaining all that hill. This hill is Man, has been maintained PK by PK the entire time. Then Powers is fighting in there for whatever. So so pa monkeys is down, but Powers can see that he's going to get a re. Okay, and then. So he does that to, I guess, beat them for position and needs. I'm assuming needs are going to be up, right? This is not a bad play. He's just doing it all alone, though. This is all alone because his closest help is number eight, explosive, and he's barely coming through. Um. So Powers is just here alone, and then he gets flanked by monkeys because obviously he's closer. So then that happens. I don't think Powers should have done that. He didn't have help. And yeah, Raver, you can see Raver picks up the nades on the lower left. So he was trying to play for nades, but he just he just staggered with them with that, and it's gonna make it easier for. PK to push through because now they have three here, so they have a 3v2. Number three, Desonite, is gonna push through the front, or uh, probably going to go through the street if he can. Whenever he can. So number seven rotates back, and then now they have a 4v3 because five spawns there. Uh, power sponsor. Uh, seven goes back to cover his lane. They're not gonna force it. They're gonna use all they have. They have one drop, and they have two nades. Also, that play from Powers doing that caused seven to leave its position. Oh, up here, which he should have been covering the drop shot from Desonite, so he wouldn't get it, or PK wouldn't get access to the drop shot like that. But because Powers died, and the potential of PK making a play through because they have numbers is 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 a possibility. Seven has to rotate. Kenny has to rotate in a system, so they have a three v three and not a three v two. Um, so that's also another effect Powers dying there had. So this one I has is gonna give the drop shot to monkeys, and Raver has two nades. So how are we gonna retake this? So they have a drop and two nades. This is they have everything they need. They have everything they need. So how are they gonna do this? Monkeys is gonna get an active. He takes Toby. He can force him to roll out wide at least, and make sure he gets the active. Nice smoke and nice flash. Um. United is gonna throw that smoke and a flash, I guess, to make it harder on the PK. But I think they're just gonna wait it out. No, he's just gonna use that bad drop. 
that push seemed a bit um a bit forced. I feel like monkeys could have just used the drop to push up to gain position further up because they threw the flash from really far back and if they had waited and used monkeys with an active to just walk out and shoot the drop to anyone that was Lancer because when he comes nice out nice flash off the start. right there's a knight throws a flash and he's not being Lancer by anyone hmm. I don't know it's not it just seems very obvious or like it feels like they wasted the flash when they could have used it to uh push for it up if, if they if monkeys missed the drop shot but they missed the drop they missed one nade raver connects on another nade kills praised they're going to split up a little bit monkeys is gonna fight uh the left side alongside desonide and raver and summons are gonna to be one explosive that is why is United set up so outside? I don't understand that. But anyway. No, oh, actually, Explosive is getting 3v1. Yeah, Explosive is getting 3v1. And now they have a 4v2 because they didn't do anything. Because I mean, realistically, they couldn't do anything. They just had a bad setup. Yeah, uh, United downward. is gonna do that immediately though immediately four is gonna cover their backside from powers maybe he saw it, maybe he didn't but that is an essential uh, side to cover because you could get flanked and make everything crumble so number four monkeys is covering the backside uh United's gonna send two through the spawn and then on this hill. Try to get Desonite out. Desonite is playing kind of far up, and he's gonna, gonna support, play aggressive Desonite on praise. Uh, explosive is pretty much just letting praise fight the one B. He tried to help him with the lancer, but they didn't really do much. So then Desonite wins his one B. Raver kills. How do you? How did Raver kill Kenny? So one in seven, up here. What is? What happens up here? So we know there's a knight kills him. So Kenny pushed up. I'm assuming Raver Lancer them, and he's cornered and just went wide on him. Uh, I don't know why so Kenny did that. He would have been better off going around and helping them the win the spawn, I guess. And then Monkey sees that they have the advantage, that they're winning gunfights, so Raven he's gonna back up and not Kenny risk dying. Well. Right now, PK in the slain he almost died, but he gets help. But it's not gonna still happen. still mating this fight, because they're still winning fights. Now, guys, is PK just again? Like deja vu so... Drop shot in, up in 28, and Nate's up in 25. Alright, so number three, that's the Knights already setting up for the next drop. Uh, United has no position on the drop whatsoever. They're all trying to focus to for Nate. Nate is going to double back and and try to contest it. He still has time, so he's just gonna be fine. Explosive is gonna contest. Doesn't mind for the drop shot. Calling out their numbers, trusting, um, you know, just trusting that hey, if we got that man advantage, we can pull away. So right now, well, the next hill I believe is going to be this middle hill where uh, Doesn't Knight and Explosive are contesting where the drop shot spawns. So for this hill, it is it is really important to have control of the stairs and and church because you can have angles on the side windows so they're gonna have a 3v3 fight here summons is what is he doing someone was down low right so summons was down low and the other two were here. So someone is just gonna push up. I don't know. 
How did that go? So much is not hurt at all, is he? No, he's 100 HP when he makes it up the stairs. He's on. He's at 100 HP. Actually, this wasn't bad. He's still at 100 HP. And then now he's fighting Kenny. He got turned around on. They needed to be faster on the left side so they wouldn't cut on summons. That was actually really good from summons to get position like that. Because Kenny didn't know. Uh, but powers cuts on summons and then he dies, so then now they're gonna have a 3v2 and uh, River is gonna back up. Monkey's still here. Oh my god, Monkey's is just going to shit on them. That should not have happened. That should not have happened. Uh, 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 worth saying though, uh, powers is being Lancer by River, which is making him uncomfortable, which can create an opening for Monkey's. PK. Mm, but I don't think Power so should have done that at all. Right oh, and ahead. Oh, no. That's not what it is. But yeah, uh, Power should have just, I don't know, I, I th he was too far up. Oh, shoot. So he just runs up on Powers, kills him, and then Raver starts crossing Praise, and then the also Raver, Monkeys also kills Praise. Wow. And then Candy is just in the worst spot after that, and Explosive is in an even worse spot, which he had dropped again. When did he get dropped? You know, it's pretty much when it comes down to it. PK, Number three. Uh, I'm assuming he threw a smoke so or something, because right he just picks it up. And he's at 100 HP. Oh, can I up the quality? Oh, it's already yeah, max. It just seems like I can't see we'll be able to take him out. the wow. HV too well. Quick work up. Explosive caught out in the open. But yeah, he's, he's just the last one. He's not gonna. He gets a drop, but he's not gonna be able to use it. So now for this middle hill. Did did Raver throw nades here? God, so Explosive obviously is gonna right die now. here. His they're gonna send three this six? way. Yeah, they're gonna send three. Oh, actually, wait. No, yeah, he. They are gonna send three, but Powers dies really early on by a nade. Yeah, Praise. Oh, not Praise. Raver throws a nade. Kills. Kills Powers, and then Kenny just runs through, and then gets killed, and then Praise is gonna hold off. And PK just Monkeys is seeker manning, being really annoying, hitting every fucking shot, and then, so for this middle hill, you need to have three people defending this top part, three people defending the top part you need to, because otherwise it gets really complicated. In trouble now, he will fall, and PK literally spawn trapping United there. So, I mean, that was just unfortunate. They just were able to defend it really well with the nades, because Raver had an aid. Uh, but the hill is going to disappear. Uh, I believe it spawns where they are at. Where uh, United is at. So they have next hill position. We know that the nerves are there on the side of E United, but they need to figure out how to get composure back into this series. Regardless, if they lose this map or... So what PK is going to do, they're going to work the outside because they saw that they all spawned there. Number two is calling out that he doesn't see anyone probably. So they're going to go ahead and and take the right side. Uh, Desna Knight wins a 1B against Kenny. Uh, I don't know when how that happened. I think he tried to seek your man maybe and miss or got break by Dezo and down. I don't know, but Dezo wins that fight. So now they have the wide uh praised and eight explosive are gonna try to play for number one, Raver. Number two, because they know they're gonna get collapsed on and angled out. Uh Raver is 
having good spacing, knowing that they want to play him. Desmond is going to flank, going to kill great, 2v1 explosive. Uh, powers, where did he die? I mean, at this point, it doesn't really matter how he died because he's at a disadvantage anyway. Number 5, he was still in a fight with number 4, Monkeys. So he's just going to get 2v1. So so that all just came through because Kenny died and then they made a play through that. They don't have any kills but they're, they're also wearing the most terrible situation because Kenny put himself in a bad spot. And he died and then they had to make a play somehow. So United's gonna try to triple push through the spawn, which mm. from those two, it just can't happen, folks. It's we'll see how it's too bad. Out. It's too hard because PK is playing really good coverage lane. Is covering lanes really well because they have three. United has three people playing this spawn. PK has three people defending. And then it doesn't matter that they're not taking points because they're going to get the kills and then they're going to be able to get as many points as they want. So, Monkeys kills all three of them here, but I mean, really, that really didn't matter. Here, Kenny does go off, but I mean, just off pure skill, just gets kills but dies anyway. Powers is going to try to make something up Kenny's play, but they're not going to be able. So, they're trying to push the wide left. Suppose it is going to kill someone. So, so monkeys is gonna play back. Powers is one shot. He gets stuck. He could have potentially killed him, and then they use the drop. Raze gets another one, but no, doesn't matter at this point. Kenny's going to get two v one or die right away, and then that's it. They get all that health. Difficult to see right now for your for the United fans, but I am hoping that they can turn it around. Man, I, I'm with you there. So right here they're lagging a little bit. It seems like, um, someone's already has extreme positioning in the in the spawn, which is good because I don't think they can really play for him here. But they're gonna try. He's gonna back up. Someone's just gonna go down. Raver has had three set of needs, I believe, if not more. I know three for sure, but maybe even more. So what 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 PK is gonna do is they're gonna work the spawn. Um, they're gonna do that. Raver is not gonna connect on any nades, but Desonai is gonna try to go through now. They use a defensive flash on Desonai and Raver. He gets it down, they're not able to do anything with it. Mm, they are gonna kill Desonite. And that was well played on them. Why is Priest not help? Well, he is helping on number, on killing number 4, which I'm assuming he's gonna die, right? Uh, Monkeys? They have a 2v2 over here, yeah, Monkeys does die. Monkey, uh, Summons and Raver have a 2v2, and then Summons just goes big. I don't know how he down Explosive, and you don't get to see his point of view, but he gets... Oh, because Explosive had to reload, I see it. He had to reload, so then he two-shot downs them, and then breaks powers, and then they just go down. That's unfortunate, but that just shows you how strong um, Team Revives can be, because... You might just get lucky and get picked up when the other person has to reload, and then in that situation, like explosive, he can't do anything about it. So they do get those two kills, and they did kill uh, monkeys. So the other two are gonna spawn across, and they're gonna work the front. Number six, uh, Praise was gonna try to go for a flank, but since his teammates died, I don't think he's gonna commit to it. He gets marked. He's gonna get crossed a little bit, and then at this point, he's just at a disadvantage fight. 
that was really smart from Raver uh, pushing his right side because he can get, I believe he can get the shot off first before Praise because he has left hand. Um, so at this point, number seven, Kenny is just all alone in the hill and three and four already made it to the hill to contest. So it's just a matter of time until he gets binged. Just not going to be too long and then dice. So they all make it, all four of them make it, uh, to the hill and defend it properly, which they need to secure this left side for sure. Otherwise they're going to get angled out. They already have number one there, Raver. Raver has one person there. He's going to pressure him. Mon uh, Monkey's going to have him really hurt. So then Raver can just go in and finish him off. Uh, United is all clumped up around their drop shot, but I don't understand why are they is drop shot gonna be up soon or something? They are just in really bad spots. And then Kenny is just ego challenging here and then Raver is gonna punish him with the right hand. Um they just gave up here. I don't know what that last push was. Uh drop shot was gonna be up, I can see it. You were able to see it a little bit beforehand, but, but that was just bad. Powers was in a bad spot to contest the the church. He got crossed by monkeys, which led to Raver finish him off, which led Kenny having to split off from the drop shot group and going to defend that. Otherwise, we're gonna get crossed from uh, top stairs, and then. He also died because he had to ego challenge and then Raver punished him and then yeah, it went down from there. So good map from Knights showcasing how you can, how you play that map. That map is heavy lane coverage when you're defending. If you're able to defend and cover all your lanes correctly so no one is at a disadvantage fight, it's, it's really going to help you. Good job on Knights.